Good morning, Solanco. Today is Tuesday, May 16th. The weather for today is cloudy with a high of 80. The lunch for today is traveling taco, lettuce, cheese, salsa, refried beans, corn, fruit, and milk. WSLC News starts now. Stone Scent will be hosting the annual Powder Puff football game on May 30th with a start time of 6 o'clock. Any junior or senior girl wishing to sign up to play, please see Miss Graybell in room 406. Cost to play is $5. Attention girls interested in learning more about tennis or playing tennis this fall for the school team. Spring open courts will take place on Tuesdays and Thursdays through June 1st from 3.10 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. on the high school tennis courts. If needed, rackets will be available to borrow. Please contact Mr. Hamill in room 609 if you have any questions. The library will be hosting a cookies and cards event on Thursday, June 1st during advisory. Librarians from Coryville Public Library will be here to help you sign up for a library card. Get set up to join the summer reading program and to register for other library programs. Bring your laptops or phones for digital registration and have some cookies as you learn all about the QPL has to offer in the summer. Fellowship of Christian Athletes annual Cornhole Tournament is back. Join us for food, fun, and fellowship on Thursday, May 25th and Friday, May 26th during advisory in the large gym. Gift cards will be awarded to the winning two-person team. Sign-ups and additional information will be available during lunches starting on May 15th. Spots are limited, so sign up today for the opportunity to dethrone last year's champions, Tyler Berger and Aiden Herr. The softball team won its first round LL League game tonight versus Mannheim Central by a score of 9-1. to They will advance to the semifinals Monday night at Millersville at 4.30 and they will take on Warwick. The ladies will need to be dismissed at 2.15 on Monday to depart at 2.30. If you are planning to go to the game, tickets will be $5 for adults and students. Attention Solanco students, are you interested in showing your Solanco pride across the Lancaster Lebanon League and beyond? Do you like to perform and exercise your creativity? Color Guard tryouts will take place on Wednesday, May 17th, 2023 from 3 to 5 p.m. If you're not familiar, Color Guard is the visual element of our award-winning Solanco High School Black and Gold Marching Band. Color Guard members use dance, flag spinning, tossing and twirling and exciting choreography to tell the visual story of our show. This year's Red Hot Radio production will challenge our members through the music of the Red Hot Chili Peppers, Radiohead, Snarky Puppy, and Rush. If you want to have fun, meet a ton of awesome new friends, spread Solanco pride throughout the Lancaster Lebanon League and beyond, Color Guard could be for you. Again, Color Guard tryouts will take place on Wednesday, May 17, 2023 from 3 to 5 p.m. Meet at the band room after dismissal and the fun begins from there. Attention all students interested in cross country in the fall. There will be an informational meeting on Thursday at 2 p.m. in room 106. Please attend to get summer training. Meet the coaches and learn more about the sport. If you cannot attend, please see Ms. Musselman in room 108. Attention newly elected student senate members. There will be a meeting in room 406 during advisory today. Today's events are Tuesday, May 16th, 2023. Algebra Keystone Testing, Senior Pictures, LGI Room at 8.30 a.m., 2.30 p.m., Basketball Open Gym, Large Gym, 6 p.m. through 8 p.m. Tomorrow's events are Wednesday, May 17th, Biology Keystone Testing, Senior Pictures in the LGI Room from 8.30 to 2.30, Basketball in the uh, Open Gym in the Large Gym, 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Yesterday's birthdays were Caroline Lance, Trevor Matterson, Avery Nelson, David Wilde, and Mr. Wayman. Today's birthdays are Dante Brown, Gavin Hammond, Sophia McCreary, Hannah Riker, and Joseph Seal. Tomorrow's birthdays are Chloe Campos, Logan Delavicha, Ariana Myers, and Katrina Zadruski. Happy birthday. Oh. On behalf of the WSLC News team, I'm Andrew Parrison, and today is National Barbecue Day.